Okay, it's almost dinner time and I just wanna film this so I can put everything away. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see her. Welcome back to my channel. Right now I'm gonna do um, a Dollar Tree haul. I bought a lot of stuff for my upcoming business. It's beauty related. First things first, I got um, a bunch of gift wrapping paper. Holographic looking one. Ooh, is that gonna be picked up? A uh, hot pink one. A metallic purple one. And just a plain metallic silvery one. So that I could do cute, uh, easy Instagram backgrounds. Two clay white pieces of paper so that I could make um, one of those photo box or whatever. I wanted to try and make my own. Cause your girl's cheap. That's why we strap in at the Dollar Tree. Okay. Color scheme. So it's really in the pastel family. So it was like a lilac. It has like an ugly-ish, okay-ish sticker, but it is um, peelable, so that will still work for me. They're like the click clacky plastic, you know, not the like super cheap ones. And then these ones, so like a plain black basket, small little black. They're like shorter than a regular like pencil holder type of um, cup. Uh, Easter pastel colors. I have the pink one and this blue one. Let's see the closure. And it's like pretty secure. Like, look at that. ASMR. Oh, these were a steal. Um, so I had to go to two Dollar Trees. Um, one of them had a better selection where I got most of like the color schemes I wanted but um, the, all the neutrals were basically gone at that store but at the other Dollar Tree more of the neutrals were there. This color was actually really hard to find. They had like really bright colors like blue, neon blue and pink and neon green but that was just like mm, I already have a lot of bright colors I want to put them in like neutral storage so I left out and got four of those gift boxes, like I guess like a fancier shoe box deal. And then I got that in the pink color too. Oh, look how beautiful. Oh, this was a two for one. Pencil box containers. These are just great. Just great to have to organize little stuff. And then let's see the clasp. It's not that sturdy, but I don't mind it because I'm not gonna put like super heavy items in this one. If I was using this for like art supplies, I would probably be a little irritated like that. I guess if you're gonna go for either the kind of see-through pencil box, like classic pencil box look, and then the more opaque pencil box lid, I would say get the clear ones because it's like the snap. It's a little more secured. But this would be great for like business cards or um, I don't know, little receipts or something that you want to stay secure and like something small. So, more sturdy. Holds its shape. Say so like heavier items here and then you can have like a lighter item so that it's um, stacking on top of each other then you can save your space. The face, so plain base for um, some 
fake flowers, not the real kind. But all again in my um, summery, eastery, pastel theme. Um, so I got a bunch of flowers. So these are like some that you'll find at Michael's or Joanne's. Um, I'd say they're probably like two to three dollar for. I've seen them at as much as like five dollar range if you get like the variety pack kind of thing. But these were all a dollar. And these are just gonna be props that I use in my background. So I'm not really tripping about like how real they look. More so like the vibrancy of the colors. This is cute. To put everything in, just to stand it all up and then I don't have to like shove it in the drawer. Just that alone looks ready. Great decor. I do like giveaways in the first like maybe like month that I announce my business launch is to put um, like eyelashes and glitter in here in the little gift boxes and distribute it to um, like my family and friends first and then kind of do like giveaways on Instagram. So in the gift bag category so also like gift bows. So this one's cool it comes with um, just like the ribbon and then the big bow and then like the dangly like plain ribbon material tool that I'm just poking out or in the pink and also in the purple so like a paper that's been shredded so in like little gift bags plasticky bags and then it has um, the tie at the top so that you can make it really look like a gift and then so imagine this with like your eyelashes or your glitter or your lip gloss, whatever is gonna sell and then you could um, layer the bottom, just sprinkle a little bit of the decorative shred. And then how cute would that be with your um, product just like peeking through the translucent parts? Costume jewelry, so like this. And then these little wands. <laughs> Alone, it looks a little bit silly, but like just like imagine just like one of these little wands and a little gift bag, like this, and like this, and then get um, stack eyelashes there, eyelash and a lip gloss would look really cute. Customers, and then you could put your little logo on here, so that's great. Again, a dollar. I don't know how comfortable this is gonna be, but. The actual bow part is bendable, so that's that's pretty neat. So I'm gonna put this on. My head looks kind of big, so got that. And then also I got like these fans. <laughs> oh God. Like if you look at it like up close, it looks pretty cheap. <laughs> Patterns look cheaper than this, but you know. It's just like up close in an Instagram picture and like it's just this much of your eye and this poking out. It, it looks pretty cool. Turn up the receipt. So for all of that, all that massive haul, um, I thought I was going to spend 100 bucks at one store. But actually at one store, which I got most of the pastel um, items, uh spent $51.85 at the other location where I got more of the neutral uh, colored items I paid $18.82 so for people who are starting out business owners you're trying to just get yourself um, on Instagram just selling stuff uh, which I'm planning to do which is what I'm gonna film this series upon is um, just starting a small like beauty business online and see how that goes. Buying a lot of your items on Dollar Tree is going to be your best bet at saving money. Holy guacamole, yeah. Mr. Cosmic, but then 
attention, attention. Calling Mr. Cosmic. I guess I have to do this video by myself. <laughs> Look, wash that out. I have no eyebrows. I don't know how to use this fancy equipment. Filming in session, leave me alone. I show to work today, huh? I had to film my video without you, huh? I was very nervous. I was very awkward. I was awkward and nervous. Just like you. Hm? You're fired. I just want to let you know that you're fired. <laughs> She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa.